ASP is back again with more Marine Corps equipment, belongings, and now jungle packs. Um, Joe, explain. Okay, this is um, a camouflage jungle pack. It's actually an army piece. It's not manufactured or, or contracted out by the Marines. Okay. It's an army pack. Some small units were issued them. There mm -hmm. is photographic evidence of it. This is the camouflage one. We'll show the OD one in a minute. And um, they really were a great design. It finally just made a big bag you could put your stuff in, mm -hmm. which is what we all really like. Yeah. You can see it still had a flap on the front for your entrenching tool. It still had a flap for your bayonet. All these straps for adjustment and to strap you know, things into mm -hmm. to carry on the outside. There's a zippered top part of it. It's just a small pouch on top for your immediate pieces that you would want something you want to be able to get to quickly. Yeah. Um, the, the suspension system was all adjustable and could be integrated into your cartridge belt. So you can all wear it as one. Mm -hmm. And uh, they were great packs. But again, basically an army piece, all, all on the orders of Douglas MacArthur. He saw how the uh, Japanese did well with, you know, in the jungle, and he wanted our troops to be able to be equipped as well. Mm -hmm. And there's contract stamps on this, correct? Oh, yeah. Yeah, it's still, it's still visible in this one. Okay. And, uh... This is the second variation we're going to be showing you. The, uh, yeah, there was no, for, no, this is the first variation. Oh, and this one's a little smaller than the OD one. Yeah. So, but the same design, all the same straps and flaps on them, and that will show you a D one. My bad. First variation. We're going to show you a second variation, and again, this is authentic, real. This is not reproduction. This is the second variation of the jungle pack. All right. Yeah. Like I said, like Chris just said, this is the other version. Same pack, same design, same size, but an O D instead of camouflage. I don't know why they decided to make them in both variations. Mm -hmm. I really don't know why. But uh, that's it. Again, it's um, right around 1942 they started putting them out. I guess that these came out first, and then the invention, if you want to say, of camouflage material. Mm -hmm. Later on, we started seeing the, the ones in, in Frosch game. Anything noticeable here? Nothing different. It's the same pack. All the straps to pull it together. Your entrenching tool. Bayonet, small zippered compartment on top, and a uh, big drawstring on top to try and keep everything as tight and neat as possible. Mm -hmm. It's all canvas. You know, uh, suspenders were also integrated into, into your cartridge belt yeah. or pistol belt. Okay. That's it. Take a look on to the next Marine Corps uniforms and equipment. Stay tuned.